One, two, three, sparks. As a photographer, as soon as I'm done pressing the button on the camera, that's when I lose any control. If we make images and all they ever do is sit on a hard drive, then they cease to exist. Frame.io, Capture One, and Fujifilm integrated into one workflow. It allowed me to regain some control over how my images are delivered and ultimately perceived. This is what we've been waiting for. I do a lot of entertainment advertising, posters for streaming shows, movies, and that's kind of my bread and butter. So today on this set, we're shooting a campaign for a sports drink. And with Fujifilm and Capture One, this is the first time we're actually shooting stills right to the cloud. If I can only travel with one person, it's my digital tech. The role of the digital tech is to ingest the imagery through Capture One, and there's a trust with your digital tech and your photographer on quality and reliability. Capture One and the Capture Station, when it comes down to actually shooting, is this nerve center where people look to for information. But with Frame.io, it's expanding that nerve center to a much broader audience. So on the fly, there can be comments coming back. And on site, we can make adjustments based on that input. They're also able to review any adjustments that I'm doing on the fly as it gets updated in Frame.io. I have been with so many photographers that have told me, I wish that this could be edited right now. If I'm just sending a raw image to someone and I have to explain, imagine that we're gonna make the color of blue and we're gonna cut this up, you've lost them by telling them that they have to imagine something. Just being able to show and build confidence on set while you're in the process of making an image, that's game changing. Frame.io has been synonymous with the professional video community for almost a decade, but the customers have been asking for more photography and stills support. So this is just the beginning of a new layer of tool sets that are gonna make the photography world really happy. Marketing before would have to wait until I got back to my house with the drive to see any selects. Now, after we finish a set, I can make my selects so much faster and marketing is already looking at stuff and telling us what they like and don't like. So we're already putting feedback on there so that it can go immediately to retouching. It's kind of like an extra gear in a sports car. I've been shooting with Fujifilm for as long as I've been shooting. I started on film before any digital photographers were used to roaming around. They, they didn't need to be connected to anything except for the camera strap, maybe. You just had to hand film over back and forth. Then digital came, we were tethered all the time, and all the stakeholders became reliant on those incoming images. But with Frame.io integrated in the Fujifilm X-H2 camera, whether I'm tethered or not, those pictures are showing up on whatever screen we've set up, and it doesn't hinder me creatively. So this is kind of like I can get my hands on what we just did. I've been doing this for 15 years. I've never had that luxury. One of the huge benefits of uploading to the cloud is archiving it immediately. A lot of times we're doing this work internationally and the client's not in that country at all, so we have to worry until the assets are delivered on that hard drive. This is a preservation from the very act of creation. You can walk offset knowing that the images on the card are not the only images that exist. With Fujifilm and Capture One, Frame.io is going to become a really powerful space for photographers to work in the cloud, regardless of what segment you work in. I can't wait to see what users will do with this technology as it matures over the next decade. It's really exciting to think that someone's gonna make an image and within seconds, another person's gonna see it and then give them feedback that's so relevant it might change the way that that image is made. That didn't exist before, it exists today.